Hi, I'm Paul and I'm a technical director. I moved from TeamViewer to Zoho Assist. For more reviews like this, please check the link below. If you look at both TeamViewer and Zoho Assist, their fundamental core competencies are connecting to a client, connecting to a remote computer, whether it's your own server, whether it's a client's computer. Something like TeamViewer has added extra features. It's added um, backup features. It's added um, Internet of Things features. Zoho Assist has now added recordings of um, remote sessions. So both of them allow you to do the remote sessions as a core competency of theirs, but there are other things that they can help you with. Zoho Assist and TeamViewer are similar when you look at their core competencies. However, Zoho Assist is better in my opinion due to the cost. The cost and the way it's deployable. Also, the security of TeamViewer is starting, in our opinion, to become a bit suspect because you have TeamViewer 6 and TeamViewer 7 and you can't upgrade to certain versions of TeamViewer. So you've got some people that are on older versions and then you have to connect to older versions. Something like Zoho Assist is always on the latest version and that makes me happy. TeamViewer, on the other hand, is known. It is understood. It is well known in the industry. If you said to someone, TeamViewer, it's almost synonymous with re remote support software. It's almost a verb now, like to Google something, you would use TeamViewer to connect. It's very good if you have the latest version of it and if you're paying the license fees to get the latest version. If you bought your lifetime version of it on version 7, it's not great anymore. Both products are very easy to get started with. Get, they're very easy to deploy. They both have MSI installers so that you can deploy them via group policy. They are good. They are both very good at what they do. So what are your considerations when deciding between TeamViewer and Zoho Assist? If I had to give you a couple suggestions, one, it would be security. Two, ease of use to de for deployment for your clients. And three, ease of use for your staff. The most important though is security. And because TeamViewer has all these different versions that are all completely out of date, that doesn't work for us in terms of security. So I think that knocks it out initially. Thank you.